on beautiful people this is the mindful wizard um i want to show you guys something it might take a minute for me to get it out but i need you to pay attention and i know you guys always pay attention but this one's a little bit more serious because it's going to take uh, uh maybe a, a higher level of thought to process what i'm trying to say so that's toby toby noigi uh noigi hopefully i'm saying that right and um he's a nigerian rapper he's a beast and the reason I bring this up is because I've been thinking about this for years of how I'm going to address this topic in video form. And yesterday, what I heard him saying after like maybe the fifth fucking time of watching this same video is that you need to tap into love if you're going to be successful. And the reason I say that, and I don't mean just successful, like work related successful, I mean successful defined by abundance in every in every area of your life including happiness including finances including spirituality including sexuality like all these aspects of our lives that make us whole and that directly relates to wellness and or mindfulness so hear me where i'm going with this um a few months ago i made a video about chess and if you really listen to the message, I was not talking about the game chest. I was saying that if you get with the wrong partner, you're going to lose. If you understand chess, the queen is a pretty strong piece. I like to say the strongest piece in the game. She protects the king. The king can only move one place. The queen can go almost pretty much as far as possible if she is unstopped. So where am I going? In Wolf of Wall Street, if you remember the story, he's a pretty up-and-coming somewhat successful relatively successful stockbroker right played by leonardo dicaprio i believe leo and in that movie he's doing well as long as he stays with the right partner now if you fast forward he starts making real money he gets with a more attractive partner leaves his main woman the main person that was supporting him listen to where i'm going while he was building he leaves her what starts to happen the drug addiction gets worse or actually it starts. He loses pretty much everything. The lesson there is that if you have a queen or a king, right? Not even to make it about gender. If you have a real fucking partner that would do anything for you, you would be stupid to lose that person because not a lot of people out here are authentic. They might pretend that they are, but they're not. Now, relative to myself, I've been nothing but successful since I've been with my partner. And that's how I know it's the right person because Everything shifted. And I'm gonna solidify this and go back to my introduction. So please listen. I'll explain. Pay attention. Look at his face when he speaks. No, that's the way, that's the way. That shit went over my head. This motherfucker said, and I quote Toby, if you're watching this, I love you, bro. This motherfucker come, came out and said, I flew out here with my wife, right? I can't, and then he stopped himself. He can't even speak this into existence. He can't even say, I looked at my wife and I let her down. That's what he's trying to tell you, that I'm doing this for more than myself. Let's look at it one more time so I can make my point repetitively. The biggest moment of his life, and he's worried about his wife. The biggest moment of his life, and he's worried about someone else. Remember that shit, bro. That's beautiful. That's beautiful energy right there. Powerful shit, bro. 